Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to study chapter number 4, Operation on Fraction, practice set number 10. In this exercise, I will be completing question number 1 and question number 2 in today's video. Other questions, that is question number 3, I will be solving in the next video because the video will get too lengthy and the explanation might get shorter. So I want to give a complete explanation of addition and subtraction as it is a new topic for you all. So let's start with the first question that is addition of these two mixed fraction. So addition is very easy 1 upon 3 plus 2 1 upon 3. So first thing what you all have to do you all have to check the denominators of both the fraction. It is equal yes it is so what you all have to do is 3 into 6 we have to change it into an improper fraction plus 3 into 2 plus 1 3 into 2 plus 1 3 into 6 plus 1 I have already shown how you all have to change the mixed fraction into an improper fraction children so the same step you all have to do it over here but the same step you all have to do it twice Okay, so this is going to be 6, 3s are 18, 18 plus 1, 19 upon 3, 6, 2, 3, 2s are 6, 6 plus 1, 7 upon 3. Now both the denominators are same, isn't it? Because the denominator already was same, over here also the denominator is going to come same. Now what you all have to do, you all have to add this. Okay, so addition you all have to do after 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26. So 26 upon 3 is your answer. Okay, I hope this step is clear to everyone how you all have to do it. It's very easy children, nothing much is to be done over here. And now after solving over here, what you all have to do? You all have to again change it into a mixed fraction. So how are you going to do it for that? I will write is equal to I will first divide and show you that is 3 and 26 so 3 eights are 24 and 2 is going to be the remainder so for writing the improper fraction you all have to write it in this pattern that is first you all have to write 8 8 starting with 8 then 2 over here and then 3 at the denominator. Isn't it easy? Let's solve the next sum now. The next one is 1, 1 upon 4 plus 3, 1 upon 2. Now you will see both the denominators are different over here. Isn't it? So first what we will do, we will first convert it into a improper fraction. So 4 into 1 plus 1, 4 into 1 plus 1 upon 4 plus 3 into 2 plus 1 upon 2 over here it was supposed to be 2 because see 2 into 3 plus 1 now 4 ones are 4 4 plus 1 5 upon 4 3 twos are 6 6 plus 1 7 upon 2 denominators are different so what you all have to do is you all have to solve it in such a way that the denominator is going to be converted into 4 over here. Okay, in 4 stable 2 will not come. But in 2 stable we will be easily getting 4. So, how you will do that? We will keep this fraction as it is. Plus 7 and 2 we will multiply it with 2. Now, once you multiply it over here 2, you have to multiply over here also with 2. Remember this step. Then what you all have to do, this fraction will remain as it is. 7 into 2 is going to be 14. 2 2s are going to be 4. Alright, so in this way, your denominators have got equal. Now you all can easily add it. 5 plus 14. Okay, now for that we have to change. So we will divide it. Division I will show you over here only. 4 Okay, I will first add it. I forgot to add it. 14 plus 5, 16, 17, 18, 9, 15, 16, 17, 18 and 19. So 19 upon 4. So 4 and 19. 4 4s are 16, isn't it? So 4 4s are 
16 remainder 3 in this way you all have to write so 4 will come over here 3 will come over here and the a dividend will come as the denominator got it so do it very slowly if you all practice these sums you will surely get the sums very easily now next is going to be the third sum which is 5 1 upon 5 plus 2 1 upon 7 so i will first change it 5 fives, uh, 5 into 5 plus 1 upon 5 7 into 2 plus 1 upon 7 okay so simple change i have done over here that is solving it into an improper fraction 5 fives are 25 25 plus 1 26 upon 5 7 twos are 14 plus 1 15 upon 7 now both the denominators are different over here in 5 stable 7 will not come and 7 stable 5 will not come so what we can do is we will multiply both the denominators which with each other so 5 into 7 so as i said once you multiply over here with 7 over here also you have to multiply then 15 and 7 so here also multiply with 5 all right now you all have to multiply and check now 26 table you will not be knowing it so for that you have to use a rough page or you all can even solve it over here so 26 into 7 6 7s are 42 7 2s are 14 15 16 17 18 okay so 182 upon 5 7s are 35 that is easy okay now many of you all are going to know the 15 stable many of you all are not going to know the 15 stable so if you all are not knowing it again multiply it in this way 5 5s are 25 5 1s are 5 6 7 isn't it easy so 75 and 7 5s are 35 now the and denominator is same so we can write it only once 182 plus 75 so again i will use a rough page 182 182 plus 75 so 7 8 and 7 15 and 2 so 257 is your answer 257 divided with 35 Alright, now over here you all have to divide it with the table of 35. So 35 table if you all are not knowing it then you all have to write it and check. Okay, now what I am going to do is over here divide you and show you that is 35 and 180, no sorry 250, 257. Alright, so over here you all have to divide it with the table of 35 so i am directly multiplying and showing you 35 7s are 7 5s are 35 into 7 i am multiplying and showing you what we can get so that we can divide it okay so 35 uh, into 7 7 5s are 35 7 2 uh, 7 3s are 21 22 23 24 Okay, so 245 is going to be your answer, which is closest to 257. So 7s are 245. Now subtract it 7 minus 5 to 1. So this is going to be your answer. In this pattern, you all have to write it as I have shown you all. So I will write it and show you. Just hold and then we will be able to write it. So first we have to write 7, then 12 and then 35. 7, then 12 and then 35. I hope this question is clear to everyone. If you all are finding anything difficult, children, do let me know in the comment section. Now the next sum is supposed to be fourth sum that is 3, 1 upon 5 plus 2, 1 upon 3. So 3 into 5 or 5 into 3 plus 1 upon 5 plus 3 into 2 plus 1 upon 3 so 5 threes are 15 15 plus 1 16 upon 5 3 twos are 6 plus 1 7 upon 3 so 
both the denominators are again different so what we have to do we have to multiply 5 with 3 and 3 with 5 all right so 16 5 into 3 so over here also with 3 same thing we have to do it with the other fraction if we are multiplying it with 3 so here with 5 for both the numerator and denominator now again as i said if you all know the table it's well and good if you all don't know use a rough page multiply it and see so that it will be easy for you all to get the answer 16 into 3 you all have to multiply so 6 3s are 18 6 3s are 18 3 1s are 3 and 4 48 48 and 5 3s are 15 7 5s are 35 and 5 3s are again 15. Now you have got the denominator same. So add it. Okay. So I will add it over here. 48 plus 35. Simply just below it only I will add it. Okay. These two numbers. Now 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. So 3 and 1. 4 plus 1, 5, 6, 7, 8, 83. So, 83 upon 15. Now, what we have to do? We have to divide and convert it into a mixed fraction again. So, 83 will come over here, 15 will come over here. Now, if you all know the table, it's well and good. If you all don't know the table, then what you all can do is 15 5s are multiply and check over here also we have already done 15 5s are 75 which is closest to 83 so 15 5s are 75 this will be 13 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 and 13 which is 8 so in this way you all have to write first we will write 5 then we will write 8 and then 15 5, 8 and 15. Got it? So in this way your first question is over and I hope it is clear to everyone. Let's move on to the next question that is subtraction. So the next sum is 3, 1 upon 3 minus 1, 1 upon 4. Alright, so 3 into 3 plus 1 plus 1 upon 3 minus 4 into 1 4 into 1 plus 1 upon 4 now simple as you all have done the addition in that way only you all have to solve the subtraction sums 3 3s are 9 9 plus 1 10 upon 3 4 1s are 4 4 plus 1 5 upon 4 both the denominators are different so what we have to do cross multiply it ek dusre se multiply karna hai. that is 10 3 into 4 then 5, 4 into 3 into 3. Alright. Now, 10 4s are 40 plus 12. 5 3s are 15 plus 4 3s are 12. Both the same denominators we have got. So, 40 minus 15. Again, we will use a rough page. That is 40 minus 15. I will subtract and show. 40 minus 15. 15 yes so 10 3 5 3 may say 1 gear 2 25 25 upon 12 now we have to convert this into a mixed fraction so 25 divided with 12 so 12 2s are 24 and remainder is 1 so write it in this pattern 2 1 and 12 2 1 and 12 got it now let's solve the next sum second sum is 5 1 upon 2 minus 3 1 upon 3 okay so 2 into 5 plus 1 upon 2 minus 3 into 3 plus 1 upon 3 so 5 2s are 10, 10 plus 1, 11 upon 2, 3 3s are 9, 9 plus 1, 10 upon 3. So 11 into 3, 2 into 3. I hope all the steps are clear. That is why I am not explaining. I am just solving the sum. 
because same steps you all have to repeat for all the questions see all the same step is coming so 11 threes are 33 three twos are six 10 into 2 is 20 20 in three twos are six now subtract it 6 33 minus 20 all right so i will subtract it over here and show 33 minus 20 so 3 13 13 upon 6 is your answer let's divide it 6 and 13 6 twos are 12 and one remainder in this pattern we will write it that is 2 first then 1 upon 6 got it now fourth third sum we will solve third sum is 7 1 upon 8 minus 6 1 upon 10 so 7 into 8 plus 1 upon 8 6 into 10 plus 1 upon 10 so 7 8 are 56 56 plus 1 57 upon 8 6 into 10 60 60 plus 1 61 upon 10 both the denominators are different so what we can do is multiply with each other that is 57 into 10 8 into 10 61 into 8 minus sign sorry 10 into 8 so 57 into 10 570 5 eights are 80 61 into 8 we don't know so we will multiply and check that is 61 into 8 8 6 fours 6 eights are 6 eights are 48 so 4 double 8 and 10 eights are 80 8 ones are 8 6 eights are 48 yes now what we can do is subtract it after writing the numbers together we will subtract it okay so 570 minus 488 10 6 4 so 2 will come over here 8 will come over here 0 so answer is 82 upon 80 now what we have to do we have to convert this into a mixed fraction so divided 80 yaha pe 82 so 80 ones are 80 and 2 is going to be your remainder so write it in this form so answer aa jayega 1 2 upon 80 isn't it easy to solve once you start practicing these sums children you will be easily getting it so don't worry Fourth sum is 7 1 upon 2 minus 3 1 upon 5. So 7 twos are 14 plus 1 minus 3 into 5 plus 1 upon 5. 7 twos are 14 plus 1 15 upon 2. 5 threes are 15 15 plus 1 16 upon 3 fives are 15 15 plus 1 16 upon 5. 7 to the 14, 14 plus 1, 15. Yes. Now, cross multiplication of the numbers 2 into 5, 16 into 16 into 2, and 5 into 2. So, 15 fives are we have done it previously also. It is going to be 10 over here. 16 twos are 6 twos are 12, 2 ones are 2, and 3, 32. Now we have got the denominator same. So 10, 75 minus 32. So 75 minus 32, 3, 7 minus 3 here, 43. So over here only I will write 43. We have to divide it with 10. Okay, so I will divide it over here. 10 will come over here, 43. So 10 folds are 40 and 3 is going to be the remainder so write it in this pattern 4 3 and 10 i hope this question 1 and 2 is clear to everyone and everyone is finding the sums easier if you all are having any difficulties do let me know in the comment section see you in the next video till then take care bye